Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Undermine. Other mine streaking time. We're going to be doing other mine today, but we have a little bit of a progression thing that happened as soon as I launched the game here. I want to make sure it gets shown off. Go away. The laboratory's closed. Master, I've returned with your lunch. I apologize for the wait. Oh, aren't you a slow creature, Valtrame? I sent you away yesterday. You've fallen short of my already tempered expectations. Cannot feed on disappointment. Bring them in. So we did unlock last time in Undermine the uh, the way to unlock. We unlocked the way to unlock more potions and uh, different potion upgrades here. Oh, what do we have here, Valtrame? What a stray animal! What stray animal has followed you home? This is Baba, my this Baba, my human friend. Is they assist me in my quest for mushrooms? No wait. There's a different human servant. Have they all been different? Eh, no matter. I can see that Arkness's servants wander beyond their boundaries, but you have proven useful to me. I listen closely, peasant. You and your elk friends find recipes in the mine. You can return them to me. I'll teach you the alchemy. Let my generosity be known. Human friend, enough sulk and bell train. You have work to do. All right. So we can get either increased potion duration, which I'm just going to do with, without even thinking about it. I'm going to do this a handful of times because it's truly important. And plus, it costs gold, which we don't really need to be carrying into an other mine run. And by that, I mean we don't need to at all. Uh, we should get a couple new potions brewed if we can. Pull the heavens down on your foes. Church bell. These are the only potions we've unlocked? These suck. Huh. Maybe I'm actually not gonna get any of that yet with my uh, with my crystals. Maybe we'll get some uh, some other items instead to add to the pool. But we're definitely gonna do all kinds of upgrades here because they're pretty cheap and they make a pretty big difference. I'd say more than three potion slots is starting to push it a little bit. Uh, but let's do that and see. I mean, it's not pushing it in like, it's still a very, very obviously good idea. Uh, I think that... Let's get the 60,000 health piece there. That should be quite good, quite handy for later. Uh, and then what else we got in here? We just have the start with an extra. We actually can't even do that. Let's go back here. Uh, but like I said, yeah, I guess we're basically, let's just keep this money for the next time we do an undermine run, I think. Uh, I don't really care about the gold keeping stat. It's not that big of a deal, but I kind of want to see if there's anything fun we can add to our item pool that may show up here in other mine. Obviously, that is a very fun one. Breastplate. So we haven't even been able to, to uh, see all of the different armor. We don't know if there's a combination, but I'm actually going to get duplicator. Also because that's going to be really... We don't get to keep it? Why don't we get to keep it? For our other mine run. You're supposed to be able to keep the first one. I'm so confused. Anyways, it's been three minutes. We haven't started a run. Let's go. Storm 16. Thank you very much for the support on Patreon. Getting your name on a peasant. You will be the peasant for our... I don't know. What was it? Streak 5 or something? In here. We'll know at the end of the run. As always. It's a, it's exceptionally hard to keep it straight when we uh, are doing half and half. Okay, this is a really, really open-ended start here. We have decent throw stuff and decent swing stuff at the same time. Uh, between the Firebird and the Canary, I think I'll just pick the Canary. Obviously, we could have gone, like, Firebird, Sears Bomb. But it's like, what do you do with that, then? Also, I'm definitely going to take Lot Cost or Convert it into Health, because I actually consider it to be a benefit early on. Increase attack damage and speed when killing enemies. Between the two, I am honestly not really impressed by either of them. And especially since we did not go with a fire burn, I'm not going to go with that bomb there. Uh, throw damage or HP regen. Let's go with throw damage. We should at some point here do the uh, the quote-unquote hard mode. Siegfried's A Aegis. Aegis. Siegfried's shield. Unlocks a really, really solid item. I don't know if it actually straight up unlocks or if we unlock a recipe. I do not remember. Either way, it's a very good item that requires a very annoying run. Conductor. Hmm. Zap enemies when we pick up gold. It's, you know, it's the start of a, a of an interesting potential run by chance. You know, like like I was say, there's 
all the different types of uh, types of runs you can get in one of the weird, kind of obscure ones. You can sort of do a gold-focused run. Uh, truly, it is more of a supplemental thing because it's not going to... If you go for a gold-focused run, you're not going to really kill a boss with it in any way ever probably ever for oh i should have done that probably ever for your entire life never ever forever hold on why do we have two shrines does it think we have holy guacamole oh my god, this is the best bug on earth. Hell yeah. I don't I, I can't believe I've just done that in that way, but uh I think this is the best bug on earth. I think it had maybe something to do with the fact that we um we really goofed up how we um <laughs> handled that like meta progression thing in the beginning, like how we we tabbed out of the run, or we closed out of the run before it happened. Maybe that's what it is. And maybe that's why we weren't allowed to pick up um, the unicorn horn as a starter, like a quote-unquote starter type item. That could be. Because maybe it thinks we have holy guacamole. It's, very, it's clearly very confused about what items it thinks we have. I am excited to see what else it may be possibly thinks we are gonna have very very excited to see but we're gonna pop on down i don't really want to get another major curse right off the bat just like that i mean we already and by another i mean our our first no we we, we do have the one but uh hmm. we got a lot of work ahead of us as far as removing curses i just kind of wanted to stack up some value that is almost certainly a secret room it just is giving me mega secret room vibes but yeah, we'll, we'll we'll see here. Got a little bit of a like a jack of all trades, master of none situation going on. Just by the uh, the lack of options in the shrines, we maybe should have picked up more shrine shrine options in the shop. I think it was available. If it shows up again, we almost certainly should. I'm gonna go with this for now. It's cheaper, and it's, I believe it's the same kind of like amount of increase, sort of. So I think it might be kind of handy. It is gonna be nice to have uh, like opening up locks with our HP for now, since it's early game and keys are not as plentiful as uh, health drops probably will end up being. We just gotta be careful. That's all, just gotta be careful. We're doing some pretty good damage. See, if I would have known we had a, a, a messed up, in a good way run, I might have done it things a little bit differently, huh? Mm. It's, it's, it's not bad. It's not exciting, but it's definitely not bad. Here's the thing, it's probably saved me on a run, I just don't know it. I don't think it's bad. You know, it just saves you a lot of damage at really low health. Should we go to the Black Rabbit? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Okay, this is very dangerous. This is a very dangerous thing we've done. I got, I have to know. Okay. I was gonna say, I just, I had to know if it thought that we had other items or not because that would change things up but with the fact that we are going to get or at least hopefully we are going to get so many uh so many different shrines eh, this could be a really big deal it's a very very potentially good item that or we're going to literally just throw like right now those are our options we're going to throw right now hopefully like I'm kind of like trying to put a little bit of stock into um, a little bit of stock into our Aegis here. Oh, I could have cooked that. I, for I forget that that's 
Maybe we can try and let it shine a little bit. Oh, birthing pod. You are expensive. Expensive as hell, and you would probably kill me, especially if we can't remove this curse. But dang if it is not so early, and imagine if we got the Sylph. Which... There's a non-zero chance we get the Sylph. There's definitely a non-zero chance we get the Sylph. Hmm. I, I'm wondering, I'm sure as heck wondering... The thing is, we could go up and we could remove curses and we would still heal. I'm, I'm very conflicted. Because if we can remove some curse, if we can remove, uh, like, the, the locks costing health at this point, I think that'd be a good, good trade now. With the option of maybe getting the birthing pod on the horizon, but almost certainly not being able to get the birthing pod because it seems expensive. Uh. Hmm. Mmm. Okay. Alright. Well, it's very clear we're not going to get it. Unless there's like a stealing potion in here. I can't, man. I just can't. Alright. How much does it heal? 32. Okay. Doesn't heal? Oh, God. Alright. Alright. Let's just stack them up, and uh, I was kind of hoping we would maybe get some multiples of the same kind somewhere. Sort of my hope there. Maybe should have done healing received, but alas, here we are. Back nearly at full health. We could even get the major curse and just really go nuts. Uh, birthing pod confirmed. Confirmed no. I would love to get rid of our uh, our shop negative discount. <laughs> you know, the uh, the whole reverse of the discount thing. At least we're gonna be generating a little extra money. Maybe I should have gone for the meat. What is this one now? Crits beget crits. I think that this is just a really, 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 really solid item. Uh, we have like a decent amount of benefits, but the things we have a decent amount of drawbacks as well. The thing is, if we continually cool, 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 because we're in kind of a weirdly, weirdly precarious spot, it'll be nice to have a, a joke, joke boss. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay. Good deal. It's not that we're like, I wouldn't even call us weak. It's just precarious. We have so many, so many curses, and a decent amount of them are uh, are harming our survivability. I, I, I actually couldn't move. What the heck? What on earth? What was that? All right, all right. That could have been so bad. If that was our last hit, I would have actually freaked out. <gasps> okay. Maybe now we're going to start to get more potions. Iron Glaze is pretty solid. It evens out all of your keys and... Uh, ooh, let's go with swing damage. It evens out your... Oh, God. This is a problem. Even that's your keys and bombs. So if you have like 100 bombs and zero keys, you drink it, you have 50 of both then. Uh, you know, just add them up the bottom of two. That's what you got. We need some serious curse removal. Like, to just such an extraordinary degree. The good news is... We can remove curses... For not really that much of a cost. Beyond, uh, like a little bit of HP. If we got some healing upgrades, it'd be a little bit different story. Ah, ha, okay. Here we go. Here's what we're gonna do. I don't care about that one that much, so we're gonna do this. Good deal. Got rid of a pretty good one. 
All right. Let's remove. Let's remove. Let's honestly remove again. All right. All right. This is a cool, if totally uh, exploitative run. <laughs> We, uh, we got a, a good thing going on that we're not supposed to have, and I am frankly here for it for today. You know, it's not often that a game gets bugged in a way that's beneficial to the player. Am I wrong? Doesn't it always feel like it's never in your benefit? Or is it just you never remember that stuff as much because it's way easier to remember the fact that you're frustrated or angry at something than it is to remember that you're happy? Boy, ain't that just great. Oh, God. I don't think I really want to sacrifice health right now. I, like I said, we're kind of in a weirdly half-precarious situation. God, we have so many important potions to unlock still. We have the, There's like the transmute in a bottle that's so nice. You can literally put transmute station, uh, a transmute station wherever you basically want. Um, yeah. Tanks. Tanks. Sure. It's one of one of my preferred bombs, I'll be honest. It's it's up there. It's a very good utility bomb. Very, very good utility bomb. It also makes it so you just get money every time you find a uh, secret room, too. Via bomb, at least. Is this Ara? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Nice. Should we go into debt for Bomb Doubler? I think we should. I think let's go into debt for this stuff. And move on. Should we even remove... I mean, I really want to get rid of Vulnerable, so... Alright. We're in extreme debt for a while. Extreme debt. There is a limit. I can't remember what it is. It's like... It's, it's not super high. Uh, yeah, 2,500. I don't even know if there was a point to do it. Yeah, there's a point to do it. What if there's something so amazing in here it's worth going into extreme debt for? Like gold and delicious and, uh, and gold dupe. We did just have such an amazing bomb run. I, I'm not feeling like aggressively itchy to get another one. Also, like the gecko bomb or whatever the heck is actually just trash. Oh, the timing on that was absolutely great. Gecko Bomb is a rash. Okay, we do not have the reflector. Boink, boink, a doink. 200 HP to go in there. We need to be careful not to do that on accident. Honestly, sure. Here's the thing. This doesn't block the door. Does it? Obviously, it'd be ridiculous if it did. At worst, it would basically just straight up kill me, though, right? Like, at, at worst, we are we would literally die. Don't we have conductor? Yeah, we do have conductor. Oh, we do have conductor. Keep on moving. No. No. Okay. We definitely should have focused down the imp before literally anything. We're in so much pain. Yeah. Honestly, yes to this too. I think we'll prob we probably will get... Um, probably will get 10 curses. Right? It's kind of a weird run. Hey, I knew it. I didn't, but then I did, though. Okay. Uh, I do want to check and see if there is a secret room. There's not. There could be a secret room to the east of this room up here. Oh, my God. How much bomb damage do? Okay, 68. We maybe would have pushed ourselves out of the pit. Uh, I'm kind of thinking of going back to find a little bit of... Well, first of all, should I secret room hunt? I just want food. It's, it's like... 
It's just so worth it right now. It's not even funny. Uh, we could also spend, you know what? Let's spend one bomb. Checking to see if there's something that is super crucial. I mean... Should we just... I... Uh, no. Okay. The bombs are tempting, though, because we could get money back. 165? We can get more than 165 out of these if we start to actually use them. Correctly. Like, right here, I think this is worth it, right? Let's let's do some math. How much did we get there? That We, we got, like, over 100, right? So, yeah, as long as we blow up two rocks with one, or two rock-type things with one, we're making money back from all of our bomb purchases. Okay. Keeping my eyes out, keeping my eyes out, trying to do what I can. Big brain man. He's not here, but he I want to be. I'm definitely, here's the thing. I'm tempted to, I'm going to bomb this so we at least get something, and I'm pretty sure there's a secret room somewhere here. Yeah, there's two. Two. I also realize we're probably not going to get ten curses because we have Aura. Aura's just like completely, completely game-changing in a kind of busted way. Okay. And look at that. We're just like that. We have almost gotten back to, uh, I say almost got back to not being in debt, but that's not entirely the truth. The other thing is we do have Bomb Doubler. Next. Next. We're probably going to have uh, bloody locks for like a while, huh? I think we'll actually get back to an okay place by the time we find the uh, fight the boss here. Find the boss. We know where the boss is. He's right here. Hello. Oh. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. Very bad. Very bad idea. Okay, I think we may be just out of debt in... No? I always underestimate how long it really does take. Takes a long time. Okay. This is a good idea, even with the poor shop thing, right? Because of our gold gold doubler. Strictly because of gold doubler, I assume. Oh, hell yeah. Debt? Never heard of it. I'm going to definitely put myself right, <laughs> right back into it, though. Um... Because I kind of want to do this. A little bit of weirdness, I'm aware. Uh, nah. 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 I don't hate the uh, locks for blood scenario. I'm going to remove one curse. So we activate Aura. And now we can start to literally just remove everything for free. Uh... Yeah, I mean, because these are these are all just free blessings now. Truly great. I would like to not have uh, vulnerable. <laughs> yep, yep. I would not like to have vulnerable. But it is what it is. We actually have to. Oh, we actually have to use keys now. Uh, this is fine. We actually, you know, we got a decent amount of uh, of crit chance. I mean, we can't, at least we can. Uh, whoop. Okay. Okay. Boink, boink. A uh, doink. Did we get the crit chance item or crit, uh, the, 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 deal more damage when you crit? Hey, that's really quite good with the, uh, Canis Major. Okay. Which is the kits. Crits. Crits beget crits. There's no point to go that way. Okay. I, I just... I want to go. I want to go. Tempted to bomb that. I don't know why. 
Something about seeing them so close to each other makes me very, very tempted. <sighs> yeah, thank you. I mean, like, we're in an okay spot now. The thing is, we probably will just get more and more strong, so it's not that big of a deal, is it? Ho ho! Ho ho! So, yeah, we're, we're gonna be fine. Obviously, I always want you as my final boss since you're such a joke. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Uh, potion? Yeah, we're starting to get potions all over the place. Seasoned kernels is very nice. That dupes our potion, or, uh, dupes our potions. No, but there is a thing that does. Uh, dupes our, um, our food, which is quite handy. I I'm kind of tempted to go with demolition since we have gold powder. Increase fall damage, sure. And then, uh, phantasmal axe because we can't take two bombs, so... You know what would be a very, very cool idea for, like, a legendary bomb item? That would take probably a lot of work. Oh, really? Is a... It's a legendary that would stack... Oh, do we not have aura? We don't have the aura buff. Ah, it's fine. I'll do this anyways. Uh, makes it so it combines the two. It combines your two different bombs into the same one. Like, kind of like Enter the Gungeon's duct tape, but for your bombs. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Yeah, we can do this one. Both of these are annoying, so. Alright. Doink, 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 doink. Pretty fast attack speed, pretty fast, or pretty high attack damage. Oh boy, what a beautiful day. I don't know why we were graced with such a uh, such a beautiful beautiful game break, but I will surely try not to squander it. Oh my god, I literally almost just did. Come on, come on, zap them all, zap them all to hell, zap them all to hell, my birdie boy. Come on, you got to do better than that. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. See a room with a lot of rocks, we can have a lot of fun with it. Man, I, I'm definitely bummed that um, Vulnerable is the one that really just took so long to get rid of. Because it's really bad. We do have to bomb these to get to the chest. And we will zap boyos anyways. So, hey, it's a win-win. Thank you. I actually would really love that right now. Extra handy when we have Vulnerable. There wasn't a uh, secret room to the right, was there? That would have been nice. That's okay. Wouldn't it be nice if there was a secret room to the right where we could enter from? Uh, 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 uh. Okay. You gotta go. Oh my god. Okay. Our crits are pretty wild. Oh, come on. Come on! Why? Okay. I want health back and a way to remove a curse back. We are swimming in money now compared to how we have been uh, this uh, majority of the run. Oh, that's God tier. Uh, what does our bomb do? 68. Buy it all, man. Just buy it all. Is this is a. I think this was a, just a one key, and we just didn't have it. But yeah, yeah. There she blows. Now every secret room or every uh, every item room will have the option between two items. It's almost always a very good item. It has one drawback, and it's called you can rip through all the items in the game and then you get an item called hot cross buns which has literally okay not literally no value it gives you one max hp up i'm not kidding exactly one max hp up so it's a very very useless very very useless item uh 
but it turns every every item you see after you've seen every item once or every item in the pool once then that will happen and it's kind of like you know great thanks uh so it's kind of a, a weird downside it's a weird downside i would rather bomb i guess question mark i don't know wow that was terrible wow Knight's Pendant is not bad. I just think we can do better. Salamander's Tail. We have not fought Nori yet, and it's just so good on Nori that it's worth thinking about. Also, the ability to cook all food we see for the entire run is really, really nice, too. Basically, right now, I'm kind of just hoping we find a stinking uh, shrine. Oh, I just want to put the bomb down. I just want to put the bomb down, mister. We could have... I was kind of thinking of bombing myself. That's why I got the bomb damage up. I might bomb myself if we get another bomb. We have the... We, we are weakened, so it would do more for us, too. Which is... Holy crap! Oh, boy. Maybe the secret room has a bomb. Oh, my God. That laser beam could maybe, like... I don't think it would literally kill me. But it could, it could come very close. Oh, come on. No, not like this. I think we go in here just in case. We could get an item that heals us, basically. Good. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what, a, what a way... What a big brain way to go about that. And by big brain, I mean not that big of a brain, but boy, it, it feels good. There was there was very clearly one way to do that. There's very clearly one correct way to do that. Those almost pay for themselves. Like, they literally almost pay for themselves. And finally, that's gone. Oh, hell yeah. I think we just start to get some keys. Get an extra bomb. I don't know. There's just not enough there to uh, to work, be worth transmuting, I don't think. Oh, we can't jump over this guy, That's, which is pretty much my favorite way to handle him. Okay. I'm mostly just trading my bombs for money at this point. Like, I'm, I'm, I mean, that's... It's what you do with gold powder. What is up with this? Why? What are they thinking? Putting this many of these guys in such a small room on not the final floor? Are you kidding me? This is very, very, very not, not correct balance. What are you doing? Not a good idea. Not a good idea. Wow. There we go. What a, that is way too many very large boys that move erratically for such a small space. It's just not not a good idea. Oh, wait. We can't cook this food. It's golden food. It's okay. We're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. Okay. Give me a drink there. We're going to be fine, but boy... That room should not exist unless it's on the last floor. And honestly, I don't think it should exist on the last floor. I think there's just not enough space in the room for that many guys. It's it's just a matter of, like, there literally not being room for them. Okay. Get on out. All right. We still have R if we book it, but I doubt that it, we're going to make it in time for a shrine. Unless that's one right down there, and we and we do make it. Mm -hmm, but I doubt it. I doubt it. I doubt it. I'm trying to go so fast, and it's getting me killed. I'm... Oh, my... Oh, my God. 
that wombo combo. I literally was just trying to go so fast that I could activate Ara, but it is not worth it. It is not worth literally dying for. It's not worth literally dying for. Yeah. Ten goal away from those being um, literally break even, which is crazy. Okay. Buy that, take it with us. Just, just as good as Aura. There you go. Just as good as Aura. Except you do have to pay more for it. Okay. Here's the thing. I don't think you get gold from this. So. Oh! <gasps> Transmute in a bottle. That's the one that puts the transmute station. Go, go figure. If you couldn't, uh, if you couldn't piece that one together, it is a transmute station in a bottle. Sir. Okay. Anywhere we can get four in a row, I feel like it's just worth it. We're gonna get so much money. Three feels like it's probably worth it as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? Fine. Teleport when hit is super bad. Flight potion. Is it worth my time? It's like, it's like never even, in my opinion, worth my time. But, like, it, pr I probably should pick it up. I'm aware. Doing this now. Oh, my God. We were just a little premature on that curse removal, huh? You know what? Ah! Ah! Say, so, you know what? We got so many keys. You know what? We can do better than this, too. Alright. Sustain confirmed. We will not... We will not die unless we're on a boss fight now, basically. Starting in a smidgen... God, that's so annoying. We are so close! Don't know what I was thinking there, but boy hurt now. We just need to get like a little bit of momentum with the gold and gold tooth will literally, it will just keep us alive. It'll straight up keep us alive. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to lose it right away, but like, fine. Dramatically increases damage breaks when hits. Okay. I mean, that is pretty dramatic. That is pretty dramatic. That is very dramatic. It need. I mean, it needs to be pretty darn dramatic. Uh. Okay. Get a little attack speed. Why not? I wish I had the swing size blessing. I'm almost thinking we don't be dumb for once and we actually like get a little bit of survivability for when we inevitably do get hit. Uh, I, I, I love having this going into the boss. I am going to lose it on Seer probably, unless we kill very quickly, which, you know, we can. I'm not saying it can't happen. In fact, like it seems pretty darn likely even. Yep. All right. This item is god tier. Thank you for actually actually making me immune. Coffee heals like a little bit of proportional health, a little bit of health proportional to what you got. I'm waiting for that fire to go away. I don't trust it. Uh, it also gives you a little temporary move speed. It's okay, I think. If I remember correctly, it's fine. No thinking, only doing. Um even faster swing speed, why not? We kind of got to go quick because of our buffs. More mimics than you like. Lock shots are extra locked. Uh, let's go with more mimics than we want instead of having to spend more keys to get into shops. We're going to be kind of a throw run, I think, until we lose our buff. Because throw runs are just... They're just safer, you know? It's safer to be at a distance from an enemy. It's just how it is. I almost lost it. It's just safer. And I wonder if... 
our Zap Zap build is going to help us out. How much is that doing? It's doing drastically more, but unfortunately, drastically uh, a drastically higher percentage of, like, four damage is still eight damage, you know? It's, ain't a wow. It's, it is doing a lot more than it was. I will give it that. Uh, food from chests or break spikes take names. I'm actually going to take this for a slight movement speed up. This is a wild, wild choice for me. Um, but I'm doing it because I don't want to accidentally uh, step on a spike. Boy, that'd be a way to go. Uh, that'd be a, quite the way to lose our big old, big old buff there. Too late in the run to move towards gold stuff. Uh, I'm actually going to get a little throw damage. Why not? Why not? If we're going to be doing a throw run for a bit, maybe if we increase our throw damage a bit, we will... Uh, not like this. If we increase our throw damage a bit, maybe we'll be able to keep it longer. Hell, like... Maybe we are... We should be a uh, throw run at this point. Just because it's so much safer. We can't take damage in any way, I don't think, though. Is kind of the uh, weird downside. Reroll potion, short. If the armor protects us, that's amazing. Okay. Like, if it protects us from losing the dagger, that's super nice. Do we have Aura still? We do. Should probably backtrack for that. Oh god, this is a this is a room. This is a room. Thing is, you kill so fast, nothing matters. Uh, I will probably keep my reroll potion I paid for. Nope, I'm nope, I'm nope, I'm pretty, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure. It says breaks when hit. That leaves a little bit of room for interpretation. I, I'll say, in my opinion, it's, it seems like a little bit of room for interpretation. Honestly, this is a new, better glass cannon. Like, in my honest opinion, this is just better than Glass Cannon. Would I, like, want both of them at the same time? Yeah, that sounds great. That sounds lovely. Might as well bomb our way in right here, I guess. Should I care about that key? I don't know. We're, run we're running out of time to care about stuff. Can't really save extra food on the ground, so I maybe shouldn't have, oh, shouldn't have done that. Uh oh. I sense damage. Well, at least I would if we didn't do just so much of it ourselves. We're giving them no time to do said damage. No time at all to do said damage. Skeletons. Notoriously my nightmare. The, the, see, this is the thing that the ceremonial, like, this is what meat bun runs in Gungeon turned into. This is what this will turn into is the whole run is me saying, oh god, this is where I'm gonna die. This is where, I'm, or this is where I'm gonna lose it. This is where I'm gonna lose it. I really think there's a secret room down there, but I just. I'm on my way, man. Oh. This is certainly messy, but I think we're fine. Stacking our crit chance even higher, too. I shouldn't have done that, actually. It's okay. All right. <laughs> Is this finally the run where... T I should have used my potion. I don't really care about either of those. What was I, I... I just don't think I've ever actually held on to one of those this run. So I didn't even think about it. I didn't even... Not even for a second did I think about it. Oh... 
We are not gonna get hit. We can't get hit. Well, so uh, there we go. Just adjust the rules a little bit, huh? I'm out. I don't want to go negative because I think it does. I think they fixed it and it does carry over to the next other other mine run now if we go in debt. I could I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it does. Okay. So far so fine. Yeah boy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a throw run. This is a this is turn into a throw run until we get our uh, until we get hit. But we have a little extra leeway now, so that's worth going a little a little under for. Definitely worth going a little under for. Oh no! Oh, oh. I don't know why I did that. We could reroll a specific relic we have which i do really love that potion now that it's been changed and buffed but i don't think it's worth losing our free hit that we get to have and uh not lose ceremonial dagger for we get one free hit now without breaking it so that's really just that's just more important to me boom 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 now we can, in theory, do some a little bit more meleeing, and it's not nearly as risky. Especially since it, it kills real quick. Fire will still get rid of it immediately, I will say. Fire will still get rid of it immediately. Yeah. Oh, this gonna be good! Big number. It, it, am, am I right? Is it called Ceremonial Dagger? Where's that sucker at? Did we lose it? No, oh, there it is. Obsidian Knife. I like pulled the name out of my butt. I literally just made one up. I mean, it kind of it looks like an obsidian or a ceremonial knife. It does look like an obsidian dagger too. We just lost our uh, our buff there. I know we should have probably taken the. Uh... Yeah. Sure. There's like there. Uh, what was that food item? Was it food from chests? I think so. Yeah. Eh. Okay. Part of me wants to just fight the boss right now because I think that we could um, pretty easily pop him with this current situation. If we get hit and we do lose our ceremonial, not actual ceremonial dagger, that's a different story. I'll look for a damaging potion here and then move on. I mean, does not get much more damaging than that, huh? Um, you know what? I will do this too. Yeah, okay. Reroll. No, they don't stack. Okay. Let's see if we can get another one of them over there. To be okay. There we go. Big number go! Big number go! Big number squad! Big number squad! We don't have lots of time. But it's okay because we kill real fast. I am got a, a rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Here we go, big number squad! First phase kill. Where are you? All right, big number squad, rise up. Uh, Ghostly Icker heals you over time, proportional to how many curses you have. Uh, so it's like the regenerative potion, 
the troll troll sweat where it heals you one or it heals you for one point every like second or something it's like that except instead of one it the number is whatever uh, you have for uh, for curses uh, post and true sight you can probably imagine shows you where secret rooms and secret rocks are ghost pepper sauce we don't talk about it it's garbage all right other mine crown eight so we are on a streak of seven just like that bada bing bada boom storm 16 thank you for the support on patreon if you want to get your name put on the list of peasants you'll be put right up to the tip top if you support it the uh the the tier that <laughs> that says so on patreon.com slash retromation link at the very top of the description thank you for watching though i had a great time this run this was like a very very clean run uh obviously we had some kind of weird busted thing going in our favor i loved it thank you thank you and i will see you next time bye